Good morning, my Geminians, and how are you guys doing on this wonderful air sign day? It is a beautiful spring, but chilly uh, day here in Northern Indiana, but I hope it's warm and cozy wherever you are. I have nine of wands reverse on the main deck. I have ace of swords upright on the clarifying deck. By the way, this is golden art nouveau tarot, the clarifying deck, and this is the wheel of fortune tarot. And nine of wands reverse, is a lot like an eight of ones upright it's releasing the fear releasing whatever has been kind of plaguing your soul plaguing your your existence and just moving the f on and ace of swords is the yes card it's it's new it's um it's it's a beautiful feeling and it usually comes right after a ten of swords which is acceptance you got an ace of swords a page of swords seven of cups and a moon yeah it's kind of like i feel like what um, it's like you're done with the confusions and illusions. You just want something really real here. That's just the feeling I'm getting. Nine of Wands reverse and the moon. Wow, a lot of water. Okay, Queen of Wands below that. All right, let's see what's going on here, Gemini. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If you are a Gemini, know a Gemini, feel like being a Gemini. Well, Geminians, I'm glad you're here. You could be a Gemini and this resonates. You could be dealing with a Gemini. It could resonate as the main story. And Gemini could be the cross watcher. This reading could be about a Gemini or for a Gemini. Take it as it resonates. Take it as it resonates. I just feel like somebody kept you confused in order to use you. That's just kind of the feeling I'm getting here. And you're just like, you know what? I, I don't want clarity. I just want I just want to be left alone. And I do feel like you either are in something new or ready for something new. And it, it's a great feeling. The tower and the king of swords reverse wanted to fall out, but not quite, it didn't fully fall out. All right, what is the general energy for the Geminians? Collect the messages. What is the general energy for the Geminians? The general energy. You got the eight of swords reverse. It's you feeling free. I, that's, that is a great feeling. Eight of swords reverse. Gemini's like, I just feel free. What's influencing the Eight of Swords reverse? What's influencing the Eight of Swords reverse? Feels like something new. I see the sun. The Emperor. And guess what, Gemini? We're in Aries season. Here's an Aries card. But it's you taking control of your happiness. You have, you're have you in your power. You took your power back from something or someone who was... I just feel like they had you in a very overthinking they put you on hold, ready to go energy. It felt like it was fight or flight mode and you're free from that. What's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading here? Three of swords, Libra and energy. What's in the past? What's in the past? The fool, there it is. I, I Aquarian energy. It just, and you are a knight of swords, Aquarius is a king of swords, and right there is elevation right here. The, that is a great card. Sorry, guys, let me do this so you can see your reading. The fool, the fool is a great card to be in the past. That just tells me whatever has been plaguing you is not even in this reading right now. That's how, that's how strong you are in your power. What is on your mind? What is on Gemini's mind? The Ten of Cups, Piscean Energy happiness that emperor energy is you taking your power back with every day you're growing stronger more self-assured knowing that um knowing that you did what's right even if you got screwed over you at the end of the day you did what's right and that ten of cups on your mind tells me I'm telling you, I'm feeling either you're in something new or you're ready. And because you're ready and open, I feel like this is where love's going to find you faster than you even realize. What's in the near future? What's in the near future here? What's in the near future? What's in the near future? The page ready to do. That. Look at that. Gemini. Gemini, two of ones reverse, Aries energy, making a decision for what? Are you dating again? Ooh, maybe, king of wands, getting your best threads on, putting that best perfume cologne on. Look at you, Gemini. I love it, it's great energy. You guys have had some tough energies. I really feel there is a outside energy influencing this. 
either you're in a new connection and it feels very hopeful, very good, very nurturing, and there's more to come from that. And some of you, this is this is walking into your life here. All right, Eight of Swords Reverse. Why the Eight of Swords Reverse? Gemini Energy, Geminian. Feels like you find love in every season. Why the Eight of Swords Reverse? Why the Eight of Swords Reverse? Six, oh my gosh, Six of Cups. I can't stop smiling. That's a soulmate, King of Cups energy. Ten of Cups on your mind is a Piscean energy. Pisces is very romantic, very dreamy, very hopeful. And a Six of Cups is, a, a, some of you could have gotten a connection from the past, uh, reach back out, not necessarily an ex, but something really good is growing strong here. Why the, why the Emperor? Why the Emperor? The Three of Cups reverse. Now this is can't Cancer energy, and I feel like it's it, at the very heart of the card. It could be um, unhappiness due to betrayal, due to backstabbing, due to third party. But here's another Cancer card for you, and you got the Chariot moving away from that taking a new offer ace of pentacles and this connection is so good for your soul what's the three of swords reason for the reading libra and energy three of swords reason for the reading what is it and the three look at the threes by the way i feel like you're done with the past but i don't think the past is necessarily done with you i do feel like somebody's in pain somebody's hurting and somebody's waiting for your ship to come back but you're you're not you're not sailing backwards. You're only sailing to new frontiers here. What's the fool in the past? Querying the energy. The fool in the past. Clarity, happiness, hopefulness. What is the fool in the past? Strength reverse. I feel like the strength reverse is giving up, no longer holding out hope for something else to work out. No longer also, I want to say this, no longer holding blame. I feel like somebody made you feel bad for you being who you truly are. And there was a lot of understanding and consolidation. I, I get the word consolidation for some reason. It's like you're consolidating parts of yourself. Somebody made you feel bad even though you did so much and they did so little. And, or I just, I just feel like you're, you're consolidating that. It's clarity and the strength reverse is, is letting it go honestly and and jumping into this new energy what's the ten of cups on your mind piscean energy what's the ten of cups what's the ten of cups on gemini's mind i can't wait i can't wait queen of pentacles capricorn energy you have somebody here this is definitely another energy in or somebody you're investing in and they're investing in you. But a queen of pentacles takes care of those that she cares about, she or he. And I feel like Gemini for the first time, somebody is putting your needs first. And it feels good. It feels good to be seen. It feels good to be heard and to be wanted after an energy kind of made you feel bad about all those things, no matter how much effort you put in. Why the page of wands in the near future? Is it a king of pentacles perhaps? We have a lot of true pairing going on. Why the page of wands in the near future? Why the page of wands in the near future for Gemini? And the ten of swords reverse. There you are. That's that you have you have three separate energies you have your energy you have a new energy and you have a past energy this isn't done with you the past isn't done with you so because you're in this new connection or some of you maybe you're still in this in between i feel the moment you take a new offer you got a ten of swords reverse coming in i feel like somebody's trying to guilt trip you like they did in the past I don't think, so. yeah, I, I, what, their ego needs to be fed. Why the Ten of Swords reverse in the near future on this page of wands? Ten of Swords reverse is a bit of holding on to the pain. It's it, also, I get guilt on that though. Yeah, star reverse because they see that you're not coming back. 
You don't want to heal this. You don't want to fix this. You want this. Ace of Pentacles and a Six of Cups. And this person can't stand it. They can't stand to see you happy with someone else. I'm, I'm calling it. That's what I feel. They can't stand to see you happy with someone else. You know what, Gemini? Go be happy with somebody else. It's This isn't Burger King. They can't have it their way. Page of Pentacles and a Seven of Swords. Somebody's going to try to steal that happiness, but they can't steal something that you don't let them allow them to 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 steal something it's kind of like you have to give them your energy ace of cups reverse is you not giving this Ooh! oh my god gemini i have never seen this so it was an ace of cups reverse right i feel like you're dumping this cup out kind of a bit of an eight of cups where you kind of throw it over your shoulder and walk away then you have an ace of wands so what i aces and tarot upright or yes reverse or no ace of swords is the yes card right so ace of cups reverse is a no to this i'm drained i'm not even in love with you i see you what now that i see you it's kind of like judgment now that i see you i can't unsee you like this the magic's gone the the illusions are all dissipated right so who are you saying yes to ace of wands to this page of wands as she holds it looks like an ace of wands then you have a yes card ace of swords look at that you have three aces all on top of each other you have a no a yes and a yes what i feel is a no to this but you have a yes to starting this out this feels like some of you especially if you've been single or in and out in a broken connection this feels like marriage material when you got a queen of pentacles showing up and you have all this king status this is a connection for the for um what is it for the lifetime for the pages for whatever it's called this is the connection that is worth working on and this person wants to work on it too which is refreshing for you because you're used to being alone in a connection and then feeling guilty the other 90 percent of the time that this person couldn't show up 10 percent of the time for you no gaslighting here no this and i yeah you got a page of wands reverse empress reverse somebody that put you on hold for somebody else got rejected they that door is close to them so they're hoping the door to you is open it's not you're 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 calling it death card going on here and there's the king of pentacles by the way so yeah i feel like you have a great new connection this is where the best investment can be had and the past is was a lesson it was probably more of a, actually a lesson for them you might feel it was for you but i feel like you were a test and now they got to live in the lesson of not having you. That's what I feel. All right, Gemini, have a great weekend. I will see you guys soon and take care.